There were seven candidates on set, but the focus of Thursday night's debate was fixed on two arch rivals. Incumbent far-right President Jair Bolsonaro and former President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva wasted no time in exchanging attacks, accusing each other of corruption. It's insane for a president to come here and say what he says with the utmost impudence. That's why on the 2nd of October, the people will send you home. You have nothing on my government, nothing. Stop lying and feel ashamed, Lula. Lula, who led Brazil from 2003 to 2010, is seeking a comeback just four years after he was sent to prison for corruption, convictions which were annulled last year. The 76-year-old is leading Bolsonaro in the polls, but the president enjoys loyal support from his evangelical and business-centric base, and many voters still haven't decided on a candidate. I hope whoever becomes Brazil's president does it right, without jokes or corruption. Meanwhile, the incumbent's bid for re-election got a celebrity boost Thursday as football superstar Neymar posted a video on TikTok where the Brazil striker dances to a pro-Bolsonaro campaign song. More than 156 million Brazilians will head to the polls on Sunday for a first round. If no candidate has more than 50 per cent of votes, then the two contenders with the largest share will go head-to-head -head on October 30.